What's up, YouTube? I just wanted to make another video today. Um, I haven't made a video on... I didn't make a video yesterday on Sunday. I was watching all the games. All my predictions came true. All four games. I got all four games right. I said the Packers would win. I said the Patriots would win. I said the Falcons would win. I said the Steelers would win. My prediction for the Super Bowl is Steelers versus the Falcons. We'll see how that goes next week. Uh, anyways, th this video is about... Um, well, my first my my first real like box I remember opening. Um, well, I remember opening boxes before that, but this is the box that you know my, my most like memorable box I ever opened. And you know, crazy enough, it's out of a 2007 Sage Hit box. Um, and it's not just because the card you see in front of me. I know it's a low end card, but I mean, obviously, this is a super sick card right here. Is Adrian Peterson autograph. So basically what happened was we buy this box, me and my dad are open it, opening it when I'm, I'm 10 years old at this point. It's 2007. I think I was 10 years old in 2007. Yeah, I was still 10 years old. Um, so the football season is about to start. We're opening this box. Boom, Jamarcus Russell autograph. Now, if you know Jamarcus Russell back in 27, uh, 2007. Yeah, he's a huge prospect. I mean, he's now considered one of the biggest busts in NFL history. Um, but yeah, so I, my dad predicted he'd be a bust, and I was kind of like, well, I kind of want to keep it. But then my dad told me what I could get for it. So we'll get back to that in a second. But then, boom, AP autograph. Now, AP is now a NFL Hall of Famer, no question about it, future Hall of Famer. And, you know, it's a super nice card with one of his early signatures, which is really nice. Um, one of the first autographs he ever signed. Super sick on, on the sticker. And, you know, I don't know if about you guys, but I like the Sage Hit um, design back then because it actually had college uniforms. As you can see, it says Sooners. Now they have to, like, kind of block that out. And I like the vertical horizontal view here. It's, like, horizontal here and vertical here. Pretty cool. Um, anyway, uh, my dad thought AP would be good, so we held on to this one. And I've had it ever since, since 2007. One of the big reasons I've stayed into collecting, you know, um was this this box actually and uh so there's that but then jamarcus russell you know i've told you about the jamarcus russell autograph so back in 2007 this box was on fire on fire and you know i kind of wanted to keep it my dad convinced me that we should probably get rid of it because he thought he was going to be a bust we sold it for a hundred dollars this guy handed us a hundred dollar bill at the flea market and what we were going to spend on that $100 was a Peyton Manning autograph, my first Peyton Manning autograph. Um, at the time when I was a kid, I was like, yeah, I definitely want a Peyton Manning autograph. No question about that. Um, so, you know, uh, we <laughs> funny story, I had a football car shelf. And uh, before, because we knew where we were going to go get the Peyton. At the time, I didn't do online stuff. Um, I had to go to a local car shop to get one. And uh, we we had this card shelf, and I put the hundred dollar bill on the stand until we could go pick up the Peyton Manning autograph. So you know, one of my first boxes ever. One of the reasons I'm still collecting today turned into my first Peyton Manning autograph, which it's you know, it, I mean, it's not you know one of one or anything anything like that, but it's a super sick card. One of his earlier cold autographs. Um, we got it at the local card shop a long time ago. I'll show you the back. So instead of a Jamarcus Russell autograph, which is now worth at most, at most five dollars, that someone looking like complete the Sage Hit set back in 27 or 2007, um, turned into these two guys, two future Hall of Famers. And funny enough, you know, I know it's not this year, but you know they were battling it out for the 2007 NFL MVP. I mean, they were basically like whoever wasn't going to get MVP is going to get Comeback Player of the Year. And these two were it, man. So, yeah, it's they're two real nice cards. Um, anyways, guys, just wanted to tell that story of my, you know, one of the first boxes I ever opened, 2007 Sage Hit, how it turned into be, you know, one of the best boxes I've ever opened, kind of. Um, anyway, guys, uh, thanks for watching. If you like my content, I do sports videos, mostly with sports cards. I kind of show sports cards while I debate sports topics. Anyway, y'all, I'm going to go watch the Cavs game now. Cavs versus Warriors. Um, y'all have a good night, and uh, 
hopefully I'll be hitting you up with some content tomorrow. My semester starts tomorrow. So we'll see. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you want to. And hit a like on this video. Thanks, y'all.